Here you see the Keyfile version 7 master installation screen. This appears automatically when you insert the CD into a CD-ROM drive. Alternatively, you can copy the contents of the CD onto a network drive and launch setup directly from the network. It behaves just the same. In the next few lessons you're going to see how to install all of the options presented here. From the Keyfile document server, through the classic client and the web client, to the various options for scan server, OCR and SQL interface. We also have provided free of charge the iStream imaging for Windows, which you can install if you need the development kit. In general, the order of installation should be as follows, that you install the key file document server. My preference is to install a classic client and prove that the document server is up and running before we go any further. I then install IIS extensions and install a workspace client. This proves that the IIS extension is working correctly and that the web-based client is working correctly. I then install any additional options that I need, for example the mailer for classic client, the scan services or the SQL interface.